Kiwi speed skater Peter Michael swamped in medal bid after stunning effort. Kiwi speed skater Peter Michael swamped in medal bid after stunning effort Kiwi speed skater Peter Michael stormed to the lead in the men's 5,000 metres speed skating at the Winter Olympic Games before he was swamped in an agonising near miss. The Palmerston North skater finished fourth, after being in gold medal position after eight of the 11 pairs had completed the time trial format. In the finals on Sunday night Michael finished strongly off a phenomenal pace set by Dutchman Jan Bloke Wichson to record a time of 6. 1407. I was trying to pull all the strings I could, it just didn't happen through the middle section, said Michael. He passed the lead time of 6. 15 set by local South Korean Sun Hoon Lee, but the excitement lasted only for a few minutes. Michael was dislodged from the podium shortly after, with Ted Jamblerman of Canada, Silver, and Svalund Pedersen of Norway, Bronze, both recording six. Then another Dutch skater Sven Kramer stormed to gold with an Olympic record of 609. 76 which relegated Michael to fourth. It would have been New Zealand's first Winter Olympics medal since Annalise Koberger's silver in 1992, and just the Cowantri's second overall. I kicked into it a little early, the adrenaline was pumping. I'm disappointed, but good to have the Olympics underway. Michael, a seven-time speed skating world champion, transferred from inline to ice skating only four years ago. The 28-year-old will also compete in the mass start as well as the team pursuit along with Ray and Kay and Shane Dobbin. Michael said his decision to try ice skating came after watching Dobbin compete at the 2014 Sochi Winter Olympics. Last year, he continued his rise in his new sport with a bronze in the 5000 meters and a silver in the team pursuit at the World Speed Skating Championships. He told staff last month his priority at the Olympics was the team pursuit. I am really aiming for that medal in the TP, team pursuit. I would really like to be a part of that, he said. Michael felt he had won everything in sight in the inline world, so jumped ship to complete his dream of competing at the Olympics.